So, hello. I had the pleasure of meeting this young, bright scholar who just hello. graduated from University of North Carolina Chapel Hill. That's a big deal. <laughs> it's not a small school. It's a hard school to get into. And so, um, she's very hardworking. She's gotten a lot of scholarships. She's extremely bright and she's achieved a lot academically and so I wanted to ask her some questions. Um, so the first question is um, if there are any young scholars, young students wanting to get scholarships and wanting to get into a great school like you did, what would you tell them to do? I think first thing I would say is to believe in yourself and understand your potential and know what you're worth and then after that to try not to settle because if you push yourself, if you're always searching, if you're always looking for new things, you know what you want and you know what you're going to achieve. Hmm, okay. Are there any, I guess, more concrete pieces of advice you could give to them? Like, what should they do exactly? Yeah. So, I think for me, is I started very early. I started looking into different universities and different programs when I was in maybe my second year of higher education. I don't know if that's high school for you or if it's secondary school or whatnot. So I started looking very early just into my different options. Mm -hmm. I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do, but I know I wanted to look and mm -hmm. figure out what is it I'm interested in and how can I make that into something I can study at university. Great. Yeah. Right. And so then, start early. Yeah, start early. Look into your options and also think outside the box. Um, definitely recognize that there's more than one way to do something and you don't have to do the same thing that everyone else has done. You mm -hmm. can definitely explore and there's so many different options out there, whether that if you're good at sports, if you're good in academics, mm -hmm. if you mm -hmm. have other amazing talents like arts or I don't know, if you have some other quirks, if you're you know, huh. really talented at yeah. juggling, I, I don't like know, maybe it's yeah. juggling scholarships. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a juggling <laughs> scholarship, yeah. Yeah, it's awesome, it's dope. You know, it's really cool because, like, we are here in Egypt. Um, mm -hmm. We're in South Sinai. And it's like, oh, look at this cool person. Let me <laughs> ask her some questions. <laughs> so, look. So, see, you do well in school. You get scholarships. And you can travel. Yes. Like, Felicity here. Yes. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even... Uh, what's your name? Your name is... <laughs> Felicity. Hi. <laughs> but, yeah, I actually... I am traveling on behalf of a scholarship. It's scholarship specific to my university called the Phillips Travel Scholarship. But I know lots of universities have other travel scholarships, and I know there are national ones as well. Um, mine is specific to a travel from three to six months. I chose the six-month option, and I extended my travel. So I traveled all over the continent of Africa. I started in Kenya, then went to Tanzania, South Africa. Now I'm in Egypt. That's and then I'm, dope. Yeah, I'm going to go visit some friends in Italy, going to London, going to Spain, and then going back because I have a job lined up in Tanzania. That's amazing. And that's all something that happened because I heard about an opportunity and I pushed myself and I was like, I don't know if I'm going to get this. It's only awarded to 40, no, to 20 people, 20 people, 600 applied. Wait, what's the name of the scholarship the again? The Phillips Travel Scholarship. Okay, the Phillips Travel Scholarship. I didn't get that scholarship. <laughs> I don't know anything about it, but I think you should apply yeah, too. It's, it's It's an amazing opportunity. Um, and we're given so much money, you can apply for a certain amount, up to $9,000. And I just happen to make my $9,000 stretch this far. That's, That's amazing. Okay, all right. Well, I uh, thank you so much for being yeah. an inspiration to me and to other students looking yeah. for money for school and scholarships. So thank you, Felicity. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Bye. And good luck to you guys. There is even better information and strategies that will help you get paid to be a student and get a lot more scholarship money. Now, with that said, I have something very valuable to share with you. I put together an ebook that shows you the exact steps I took to get over $1 million in scholarships as a high school senior. The ebook is 100% free and you can access it by clicking the link below in the description. Or you can type into your browser www.scholarrevolution.com. Again, you can type into your browser www.scholarrevolution.com